Hey guys, today we're doing a really cool unboxing. This is The Beast Must Die on DVD. Um, it's, does, it does not have a Blu-ray release, that's why I picked up uh, the DVD, but this is a movie that I've never actually watched completely. Um, but I saw this for the first and only time and only like the last 10 minutes of the movie um, about, actually I think it was uh, either 10 or 11 years ago exactly. Um, when I was young I would always watch uh, the AMC Fear Fest marathon every Halloween season. Um, that's how I was introduced to all of these classic horror films. Um, but this is one that I saw that year. It was either 2007 or 2006, um, way back then. And like I said, just saw the last little bit of the movie, and I was really intrigued by it and never revisited it, never was able to, to rent it or get my hands on it um, in the 10 years after that. But now that I have picked up... Uh, several of the Halloween movies, Michael Myers movies, uh, this Halloween season to watch and finally add to my collection. I figured I would go ahead and finally pick this up so I can uh, give it a watch in its entirety. Um, and this is a movie I never hear anyone on YouTube talk about. Um, and maybe, maybe some of the uh, horror YouTubers have this in their collection. I'm not very familiar with uh, the horror community, but from the movie people that I uh, that I watch, I have never heard anyone mention this movie or uh, show it off in their collection. So if you've seen this, let me know. Uh, but if you've never heard of it, hopefully I introduced you to a movie that uh, could be kind of an interesting little gem of the past. So... Yeah. All right. So this is uh, says it's the Amicus collection. I don't know what that is. If uh, it's a horror movie collection, or if they put out all different kinds of genres of movies on that label, but that's what it says. The Beast Must Die, and I do know what the movie's about. Uh, this rich guy here, he has like this far off kind of secluded mansion he invites a bunch of people over for a uh, dinner one night and then people start getting picked off and uh yeah that's what it's about special features and i'm pretty surprised that this has special features since it's such an old movie uh 1973 but uh New 16x9 anamorphic widescreen transfer, commentary by director Paul Annett, theatrical trailers, still gallery, cast and crew biographies, liner notes, Paul Annette's tribute to Peter Cushing, featurette, directing The Beast, 1973. I don't think they give any audio information as far as subtitles and things like that but let's open it up so yeah if you guys have seen this let me know what you think of it and if you know of any other really uh, special kind of one-off horror movies like this that are similar from this kind of kind of time period in this kind of style let me know because uh, not my wealth of knowledge of uh, the classic horror genre is not very deep and I'd always be willing to check out movies that you guys think are worth uh, worth checking out so let me know all right we got some internal artwork which is pretty cool for a DVD release but here's the uh, DVD disc with disc art identical to the cover art but let's take a look at this uh, internal artwork and it has the uh, scene selection listing here 
um, if you don't want to know anything about the movie or you're afraid it'll get spoiled, I'll warn you now, but let's take a look at uh, the scenes. So, we've got opening credits. I guess I won't read all of this, but there it is. All right, so that's it. Check the description for links to my other horror movie unboxings. And I will see you guys in another video. Take care. Bye.